Anyone who decides to organize a trip to Indonesia is generally fascinated by its wild nature, pristine forests, rich flora, its varied fauna, beaches, waterfalls. If you seek an escape from the routine of everyday life, from the smog and gray of winter, well, this magnificent archipelago has a lot to offer. Here are the top 10 attractions to discover to immerse yourself in the amazing nature of Indonesia. Be sure to like and subscribe to our channel with all notifications enabled so that you can easily plan your next trip with our lists of top tourist attractions. Having said that, let's get started. Number 10. Raja Ampat – A Diving Paradise For those who are really looking for nature without limits and compromises, there is Raja Ampat, a complex of islands in the province of West Papua. Dense forests, pristine beaches, crystal clear emerald sea, Raja Ampat is all this and much more. Thanks to the presence of many marine species that make it a paradise for all lovers of snorkeling and diving. The archipelago consists of over 1,500 small islands, to which atolls and islets are to be added. Its waters are home to 540 types of different corals and 700 mollusks. It is also believed that around 75% of the species in the world live in Raja Ampat. Both diving and snorkeling are therefore a unique experience here, swimming among manta rays, tuna, catfish, barracudas, dugongs and turtles. The best snorkeling spots include Kabui Passage, Arborek Island Pier, Sawandarek, Yanbuba and Freewin Wall. But it is not only the underwater environment. Raja Ampat also amazes with the beauty on the surface. Islets covered with exuberant vegetation emerge from the water, contrasting with their colors the blue of the sky and the sea. Among the forests of the islands, there are many species of birds, including the bird of paradise and several endemic species of Cusco, a funny Asian marsupial. Number 9. Bali There is no need to introduce Bali, not surprisingly also called the Island of the Gods and Surfer's Paradise. An island of rich culture, as can be admired from the wonderful temples and the endless heritage of dances, songs and ceremonies of the local population, Bali is known above all for its beaches. Here you can practice various water sports, including jet skiing and in fact surfing. But you should not forget the volcanoes some over 3,000 meters above sea level, on whose top the temperatures are cooler than the plains, where the climate is hot and humid all year round. One of the most famous beaches in Bali is Kuta, with well-equipped services, hotels, restaurants and nightlife spots. But those who want to surf would do well to move to Nusa Limbongan, near the islet of Nusa Penida. In Nusa Penida, the famous and photographed Manta Point and Malibu Point, where you can dive, are worth a visit. For those who prefer hiking, in the West Bali National Park, where you can admire the flora and fauna of the island. For a bit of adrenaline, you can also try rafting on the Ayung River near Ubud. Number 8. Wei Island Just at the mouth of the Strait of Malacca, Wei is a small strip of pristine and lush land, a paradise for scuba diving. There are qualified diving instructors to discover its famous underwater garden, meeting from very close manta rays, whale sharks, dolphins and turtles. Diving in Wei Island is a well-established recreational activity. Dive masters and dive instructors are ready to offer a variety of dive sites, like the fabled Sea Garden in Rubaya Island. You'll find many delightful sea creatures, most notably manta rays, whale sharks, dolphins and sea turtles. Come and enjoy a swing on a shady hammock by the high tide hut on an island that many divers call the unparalleled underwater universe. Although it is a small island, it gives you the sea experience and a waterfall up in the rainforest as well. Number 7. Lombok Here we are in the island of Lombok an unspoiled island near Bali from which it is separated by a strait, featuring enchanting beaches dominated by the massive Mount Rinjani and rich in natural beauty that quickly made it one of the main attractions of western Nusa Tenggara. Mount Rinjani is one of the highest volcanoes in Indonesia, with 3,726 meters above sea level. It houses the Sagara Anak Lake in its crater. In the area around the island there is the Gili Island, of which there are three main ones, Gili Trawangan, Gili Mino, and Gili Air. 
all three if you are looking for pristine beaches. Remaining in Lombok, the most beautiful beaches are Kuta Beach, Tanjung An, Maun Beach, and Selong Balanek Beach. All these beaches are located in the central area of the island, while moving to the west lies the town of Sengigi and the Monkey Forest. Number 6. Kalimantan, Borneo Few places suggest wild, untamed adventure like Borneo. One of the most ecologically diverse places on Earth, Borneo is home to orangutans, exotic birds, Sumatran rhinos, pygmy elephants, and an array of other creatures. In Kalimantan, in Indonesian Borneo, you can travel down the Kapuas River, the longest in Indonesia, visit villages of the indigenous Dayak people, and observe foreign influences from China, Malaysia, and even Europe in the ports and cities along the way. You can also go hiking in the rainforest for a chance to see some of Borneo's famed wildlife in person. Bukit Baka Bukit Raya National Park is a conservation area in West Kalimantan that includes two of the highest mountains in Borneo and supports wildlife such as orangutans, clouded leopards, slow lorises, sun bears, and many other species. Number 5. Flores Island The Indonesian island of Flores means flowers in Portuguese, a name that hails from the European missionaries who arrived in the 16th century. Lying to the east of Sumbawa and to the west of Lembata in Nusa Tenggara, the Long Island of Flores is famous for its amazing multicolored crater lakes around Mount Kilimutu, traditional village homestays and endless opportunities for adventure tourism. The lakes are truly a sight to behold in every color you can think of from browns and greens to aqua blue, colors caused by the minerals reacting to the gas of the region's volcanoes. The Kelimutu three-colored lake is a must-see from the top of the volcano at sunrise. For those in search of more physical activity, Egon Volcano can be reached with a self-guided or guided hike. The north coast has many offshore islands and coral reefs to explore with an exhilarating dive or snorkel, or you can simply relax and soak your tired muscles in the enchanting hot springs hidden within the jungle. Bliss. Number 4. Medan The fourth largest city in Indonesia, Medan is one of the most diverse areas in the country. With sprawling lawns, old government buildings, heavy traffic and glistening new malls, Medan also offers an interesting contrast between old and new. Each ethnic group contributes to Medan's wide variety of food, making it an excellent place for food tourism and a must-visit for foodies and connoisseurs alike. Lake Toba in Medan is the world's largest volcanic lake and is another popular attraction in Medan. Usually Medan is overlooked by tourists as a mere transition point to Malaysia or other Indonesian cities, the island of Penang, or the beautiful Lake Toba, but the city in itself has plenty to offer in terms of culture, food, and sights. Number 3. Makassar Makassar, a bustling port, is the largest city in East Indonesia. It is a must-visit city in Indonesia because of its cosmopolitan nature and urban attractions. As a city, it is relatively more modern but also has traces of Dutch architecture in a few places, with Fort Rotterdam standing as one of the remaining bastions of colonial architecture. The walkway along Losari Beach is one of the most popular attractions in the city. Makassar is also known for its great diving and snorkeling opportunities off the reef of Samalona Island. Pantai Lazari or the Losari Beach is the city's most famous party, where tourists may catch picturesque scenes from the sea and visit the various food stalls and the famous floating mosque Majid Amarul Mukminin. Besides these traces of tradition, the rest of the city is a sprawling metropolis, boasting the world's largest indoor theme park, trans studio, and many large malls and luxury hotels. Number 2. Jakarta The capital of Indonesia, this teeming megalopolis is a dynamic place full of life. Although its streets can feel frenetic and chaotic at times, Jakarta's almost 30 million residents are a welcoming and friendly bunch. 
Its fast pace of development means that the city is constantly changing as high-rises and tower blocks spring up, though the delightful Chinatown and colonial buildings of the Old Town help show another side to Jakarta. There are a plethora of fantastic restaurants, atmospheric cafes and lively bars for you to enjoy as well as a raucous nightlife scene. Truly representative of all Indonesia, its residents highlight the country's cultural diversity in their cuisine, customs and the products they sell. Number 1. Yogyakarta A delight to wander around, Yogyakarta is the artistic and cultural heart of the island of Java. The rich Javanese heritage shines forth wherever you look. One of the oldest cities in Indonesia, there are lots of historical sites to visit. It is still ruled by a sultan whose elegant walled palace dominates the center of town. Although the local culture and traditions are still very present, fast food joints and shopping malls have sprung up around the city. With the spectacular temple complex of Borobudur and Prambanan nearby, Yogyakarta is a great base from which you can explore the surrounding region. That's all in today's video. Thanks for watching. Write down in the comments which among the top 10 places you would like to visit on your next trip to the land of the islands, Indonesia. Be sure to like and subscribe to our channel on your way out, and we'll see you in the next one.